All right, this is Cleo with an unboxing for a uh, the StarTech Box for HD ECP conference table connectivity box. Uh, basically, that is a uh, connectivity box for conference rooms uh, where you've got the projector, and that projector is going to come uh, with uh, the HDMI uh, and the S video and all the other different VGA cables, right, coming to that unit. Uh, so, having this box in the conference room table is pretty good. Um, so, you don't have to. Uh, have all these cables hanging in and just being there cluttering the uh, the conference table uh, one of the thing that uh, you know I've seen in the past is that uh, until I saw the StarTech uh, unit which is for uh, consumers uh, you only could see these kind of units uh, in hotel uh, hotel rooms and where they don't want you to you know just put your input your HDMI cable into their TVs because they've got all these movie things attached to their uh, TVs uh, so, uh, you know, I've called uh, some of these providers that uh, for the units you would see in auto rooms and uh, they would always tell me, well, we don't sell these like onesies or twosies. It's uh, mostly for institutional customers and we sell them hundreds at a time. So that's the first time I see a consumer product which, uh, that we can buy uh, basically on Amazon. Uh, even on StarTex website, it says that it is to be purchased uh, through Amazon, either in Canada or in the States. Um, I just uh, got an alert from StarTech that this unit was available uh, two weeks ago. I got it and it was not available in the States. On Amazon, it was available in Canada, so I got it there. And so this is it. So that's going to be the unboxing. So this is what it is. The box, what it says, HDMI, VGA, mini display port, composite table surface access switch. So let's see what it looks like. What you get in the box, what you get when you receive the unit. Remove this over here. So basically you've got some uh, installing brackets that you're going to put the unit from probably from below the table. Got that over here. And you've got some uh, here this is just some power plugs. Uh, this is this seems to be like uh, like a V like a Singapore if I remember well. Uh, in Asia for sure. Uh, right. So let's see what we've got in here. All right. So let's see what we've got in the box. This is uh, some more uh, power adapters. Uh, this seems like UK. This is definitely uh, the South America. And we've got the uh, North American plug right here that you put on the adapter. So that's, you got these adapters as well. Okay, this is a uh, power adapter as well. Uh, and this is, uh, you know, for sure 100 to 240 volts. Uh, you know, it doesn't say here, but it's uh, probably 50 to 60 hertz as well. So that's good anywhere in the world, like most laptops these days. So that's what it is in the box. This is the unit protected by the um, some foam over here. I'm going to remove that. I'm just going to put it here because I'm going to look it up after in details. All right. What do you get in the box? So you've got the some more things, no more in the box. Okay. So you have in the box the uh, the measuring template. So when you're gonna cut your conference uh, table, um, like this in with working, I am a hobbyist woodworker myself. Uh, measure twice, cut once. Um, when it comes to a conference room, I'm gonna change the rule. Measure three, four, five times. Make sure everything is in the right place. Uh, before you cut your conference room table, um, you know, most hobbyists would not do that, but check what's under the area you're going to cut. Just don't put this on the table without looking below the table. If you've got like steel brackets or braces or things like that or supports, uh, usually you will have that. So make sure that uh, not only on the top, it, it fits where you want it to be, but under the table, there's nothing below it, uh, like electrical cables that are, you know, run through there or anything. Uh, just be safe. Uh, just it's very easy. Just look you know, on top and below the table. It seems obvious, but uh, I will know for sure some people will cut the table from the top and then realizing, shoot, there's something under it going through a cable or a brace and realizing they just damage your table and they cannot run that little uh, unit where they start to cut. So make sure you just look at this. It's very easy. All right. Uh, here you've got the instructions uh, over here. Uh, in different languages, uh, basically, and this is what it tells you. Uh, composite input port, VGA, uh, uh, you know, input, Ethernet input port, USB charge port. 
So you've got people there and you want to charge like their phones or something, you can use that uh, to charge your uh, device. HDMI, audio video, mini display port, audio video, and the mount mounting bracket. Uh, you know, it tells you system requirements, ta table surface, HDMI, enable display device, and network host device with Ethernet cable. Um, that's basically what it is, all right? Giving you basically, um, like let's say, carefully cut rectangle of the table and all this. So these instructions are right here. Uh, if we look at the unit itself, let's bring this baby over here. Take that away. So this is the unit. It looks good with the StarTech logo on top of it. Uh, you can just, you know, tilt this up and down. Um, you know, what I've seen so far is that, you know, maybe when it's going to be installed, it's going to be easier. But right now, it's not the easiest or smoothest uh, way to, you know, when you want to lift it back up. It's kind of, but, you know, to remove it is easy, but to put it back up, it's sometimes going to be a little tricky. You don't need to wiggle it a little bit. Uh, this is metal. I don't know if it's aluminum or, but that's some, that's metallic, that's for sure. Sturdy quality, that's for sure. And that's not plastic, so that's, that's good quality. Uh, so you've got here, um, you know, the RCA jacks, audio right, audio left, video, got the VGA, got the little audio port right there, you got the Ethernet uh, plug over here, USB for charging only. Uh, some projectors do have a USB input, but this one says USB charge, so I will assume at this point that it's only a, a charging port. Uh, it's not an input for the, um, the projector. HDMI in. Mini display port in as well. Um, if you look at the unit itself, you know, these are the ports, Ethernet. So basically, you're going to connect your Ethernet over here and it's just going to relay it on that side as well. HDMI out, HDMI out, and the 12 volt DC for which we have the, uh, the DC adapter in the, in the little bag that's going to go under the table. Um, and there's nothing else, all right? So this is pretty good. This is metallic as well steel all right uh, nothing under as well all right just the uh, the logo the star tech the, the part number box for HDECP um, this is what it is so there's only these inputs so basically whatever you put here on the first when you're going to input on your conference table your device you know uh, it could be audio over here or a video camera could become over here or HDMI out from your laptop over there or VGA and audio there separately, mini display port. All of this is obviously going to be carried out to your projector through the HDMI out. So there's really only one cable going to your projector. HDMI is gonna carry sound volume to your projector, no matter what the input is. So all this input, you know, for sure on the inside of the unit, just go into one connected to the HDMI and this from at the top gets split to the different uh, inputs but there's just one cable going out to the projector. That makes for a very clean install and HDMI as well. I think the limit of the cable that length is, is, is very long before you, you need to boost the signal. So I know the HDMI is one of the best uh, type of cables for uh, having no loss of signal uh, with longer cables versus other ones. Uh, so that's it. So. Uh, that's a pretty uh, neat little device. As you can see, there's like uh, some kind of a lip over here. Put it back. And this is closing right there like that. So uh, this is, uh, and that was the uh, unboxing of the uh, Box 4 HD ECP um, input device for a conference room. Very neat uh, unit. Can't wait to install it in one of our conference rooms. Hope you enjoyed this video.